Well, I'm Michelle Mulder. I'm from Grand Rapids, Michigan, born and raised. I did all my schooling in Michigan and then went to Miami for a seven-year general surgery residency during which I completed two years of research in surgical outcomes and critical care and then I went to San Francisco for my one-year dedicated fellowship in endocrine surgery, uh, one of the premier endocrine surgery programs in the country and then I came here to the University of Nebraska. So I'm from a long line of dentists, um, so healthcare certainly runs in my family, but I had the fortune that my dad's office was directly next to a surgeon's, so I was exposed to surgery at a very young age and I was in love from the start. Uh, the fast-paced nature of the field, the opportunity to work with my hands, and above all else, I really love the idea that a patient could come in with a, with a problem and then in a matter of hours through surgery, I could provide an immediate solution and improve their quality of life in a tangible manner in the same day. So I treat both benign and malignant conditions of the thyroid, parathyroid, and adrenal. So more simply put, I treat cancer and hyperfunctioning or hormonally overactive conditions of these glands. Um, I do my surgeries primarily minimally invasive, so open and laparoscopic. For the thyroid and parathyroid, that means a small, cosmetically pleasing incision in a natural skin crease in your neck, such that actually in a couple years, most of my patients, you can't even tell they had surgery. Um, and for the adrenal, I offer both the traditional transabdominal laparoscopic approach, meaning very small incisions with a camera. We remove your adrenal from the front of your belly. And I'm also really excited to offer the posterior retroneoscopic approach for adrenalectomies, meaning we remove it from the back. And I'll be the per first provider offering it not only here at UNMC, but actually the central United States. So it's a great procedure. Uh, not many people do it, but it definitely for the select and right patient uh, has excellent outcomes, minimizes pain, and uh, above all else, it offers surgery for patients that otherwise might have been considered too high risk. Endocrine surgery definitely catered to a lot of the key components and strengths of my uh, personality. The meticulous attention to detail, the technical precision required in the dissection definitely aligns with my never-ending quest for perfection. Uh, the post-operative success and the positive prognosis of most of the patients um, certainly was another key component as to why I chose endocrine surgery. Our patients do well, and I take my outcomes both uh, success and complications very personally and so having a specialty that the patients do well was very important. And then finally, the opportunity for longitudinal care in a multidisciplinary fashion, in my opinion, really promotes a culture of um, collaboration and constant communication, which really affords a comprehensive, individualized level of care for the patient that is second to none. So academia is always what I've wanted to do in terms of um, the uh, area, whether community or not. And I love the clinical innovation component, the fact that there's an opportunity for research to translate from bench to bedside, our findings, the opportunity to work with residents and fellows in that teaching component. And above all else, I think there are so many uh, ancillary services that together can come together and really provide excellent care for the patient.